Hey, what's up, everybody? It's me, Soul Supreme, and welcome back to the Reichsland campaign in Victoria 2. Or, maybe, better yet, it should be called the Reich Way, because we are going the Reich Way. <laughs> I'm an asshole. So, let's see. Uh, right now, we completed our conquest over Sokoto Benin down here in the previous episode. And right now, we are currently just trying to expand our influence in South America. This will be my last recording session, at least right now. I may, like, hop back on this later, but uh, I got stuff to do, and I want to get in as much recording as possible. Hmm. All right, let's have you guys all link up over there. So, what's the agenda now? I kind of, sort of, want to take over a chunk of Ethiopia, but at the same time, not really. I mean, I could like go and take over, uh, annex all of Ethiopia right now. I mean, we certainly could. There's nothing holding us back at the moment. All right, so right now, Colombia are almost fully within our bubble. I'm gonna dip down from them for a little bit. Let's see who to go for next. Let us go for Argentina. Well, I actually did wanna like, let's Let's leave that alone for right now. Let's try to influence over here in Egypt. Get a head start on these other powers. Um, yeah, everyone's still neutral with Egypt. Let's try to like focus on them for right now. So currently we are waiting for biologism to finish, which is going to help our literacy because we were at 77, 78% literacy, but after Anschluss with Austria, our literacy plummeted to like 45%. So right now we have to recover from that. It will also be useful if we could go through with like one of these school system reforms, but right now we are gonna have to wait for the elections and such. Do this properly. All right, so how's our fleet looking up here? Not too bad. I'm not gonna really worry about Man of Wars because like, what's the point? We're gonna like scrap them soon anyway. And I go, I could build a couple more steamer transports down here. Uh, crisis in Gelderland, where is this at? Belgium, oh, it's over this territory once again. Let me see, what is France's relations? Ottomans decided to back the Netherlands. Wait a minute, I, didn't, I thought the Ottomans weren't a great power. Oh, well, I guess I was wrong. I could have swore the Ottomans were a secondary power. Am I losing my mind? As a great power, it is expected of us to assert our position. Yes, let's, but well, we're gonna have to step into the ring. Belgium, Belgium. Okay, I wanna see where this goes. Let's see, if I find it favorable, I will like uh, join the war against Belgium. Just for the fact that we could take Heligoland. Uh, and possibly some colonies down here. Oh, British North Cape, forgot. We could definitely go for like some colonies. Ooh. Let's just wait and see. All right, Columbia is at 94%. 
increase relations with you and increase relations with you. Looks like the market has shifted a little bit. I am going to raise taxes on you guys for a little longer. Just hold it out. I'm trying to like modernize our nation. I'm trying to like get us as rich as possible. Gotta get to this. Once we get back uh, past 50%, we should be good. Damn, that's like the one downside to annexing Austria. I mean, you get like a whole bunch more resources, manpower, population to play with, and like vital territory. But you also take a kick in the mouth to literacy. All right, so we got enough socials and Sasha and literacy. Can I load some quakes here? You guys gonna promote or not? Okay, you guys are promoting a little bit. Leaning towards supporting Belgium, leaning towards supporting Belgium. Uh, if it comes down to it, uh, I am not like really confident. I mean, this is just a shit situation because I do not want to fight all of Europe just now and screw us over because that would be bad. I'm pretty sure we, we could possibly come out of the war fine, but it'll just be a shit situation all around, like a complete shit show. Let's see. I wonder if um, if Great Britain joins the Belgium side, I wonder if I'll promote France. If France joins the Ottoman side, then I can see something happening. Oh, and then Spain. Uh, damn it, Spain. Hmm. It's fast forward. Uh, Mummy found our excavation team working in the Valley of the Kings has uncovered a hereto undiscovered tomb and mummified remains of an Egyptian high priest of the 19th dynasty. The interior of the tomb is rich in decorations and the discovery is an enormous success for our Egyptian expedition. Research points and prestige. Hell yeah. Also, said Spain is an interesting country. Right. Yeah, they're going to try to push Colombia soon. Uh, just just keep increasing relations with them. Along with the German Empire. Oops. Increase our pan with them. Like if come on. Join Belgium right now, Great Britain. Try and see what these other powers do. If they do that, I'm pretty certain uh, France may want to declare like against Great Britain, which could be of use to us. Cause I could certainly handle Russia on my own, but going up against Great Britain, France, Russia at the same time, especially at this stage, will be a bloody mess, and I don't really want to have to contend with that. Okay, so the crisis fell to enlist interest. They basically just white pieced it. So 
Denny of P Mafia's on mic. All right, and you guys could head over here. And let's continue to build up the troops. Keep on, keep on trucking with these units. Uh, and then, all right, you guys should be good to go. Uh, all right, fleet is being built up right now. Instead, I'm gonna focus, uh, I'm gonna go to industrial techs and get interchangeable parts and or inorganic chemistry out of the way because I wanna build these canals as quickly as possible. All right, Egypt, we can increase our opinion over here. A national tragedy, girl from Dresden. Basically, girl lost her life coal mining. Beautiful. All right, since that is done, let us go for this interchangeable parts. Try to focus on this stuff right now. Uh, because, let's see. We're gonna need the machine tools. We're gonna need nitroglycerin from here. Let's try to get some of this industrialization out of the way. Yes, um, let me just make sure we're gonna need machine tools, iron, steamers, yeah, so get that started soon. And iron steamers is until 1860, okay, that's good. Enforced German curricula. That's all of our units are gathering up. I'm gonna play with this gamble. I'm gonna go for an annexation of Ethiopia. Uh, what's this? Aust East Prussia. And which one was this? Posen. Uh, boom. Y'all start promoting like that. Let's so the pops in these areas back up. So stick with interventionism. Yes, we can annex Ethiopia. And what that will do is later on we can release them as a satellite. That'll be a great plan. Egypt is almost fully within the fold. Blast! Unfortunately, our expedition failed. We are 50% literacy right now. And Darwinism. So, gotta work our way to that. Alright, our army is getting itself nice and together. Right, that should be enough and then I guess we could also oops we could also get some steamer transport some commerce raiders up and running this will be excellent all right so you guys are good you guys are looking good so the party is still in power looks like we'll possibly be able to pass a reform soon Losing money, but it's nothing too serious right now. Basically gonna have to force the market to work how we want it to. All right, drop you guys out. All right, so let's see. Justify war, establish protectorate. Let's go for that.
relationship is now within our sphere of influence. Let's kick that up a notch so we can make sure all the other powers stay out. And let's send you guys back over down here to the Bite of Benin. Seven point one infamy. That's fine. Uh, I could send down another army. How many guys can I fit on this? Uh. Already with this? Okay. Um, change of plans. You guys head over here to Egypt. This is why I'm glad I have this second fleet up. Um, what's going to happen now? We're going to raise this. Temporarily raise the tariffs. And you guys make your way down here. So already, because Egypt just started this crap, so great. All right, so I'm not going to put any points right now, like stock in Egypt. Let us go to Argentina. Start influencing down here. Uh, speaking of Colombia, let's keep increasing with you. Bolivia, increase with you. Alright, and this should be fine. Now I am glad I have seaport access to the Mediterranean. Let's finish this conflict up with Egypt. Nice and quick. Actually, drop off in Alexandria. This as far as being built. I oh, just won the Battle of Alexandria. Try to make this war lightning. All right. I'm right, starting to influence down here. We're gonna just be influencing Argentina in the meantime. All right. Uh, should be researching this, but let us. Um, let's go for this in organic chemistry right now. Try to get some of this important industrial techs out of the way before I go swing back to military. I want to get breech loaded rifles uh, soon. Right, you head over here. Illness funds. The Krupp Company and Essen introduced a health insurance fund for their 970 workers. Membership is mandatory. All right, let's just go for that. Let's pass these reforms. You gotta sail all the way over here. You gotta have to travel through there. Great Ottomans are gonna do something stupid. If they try to take Sinai, I'm gonna have to kick the Ottomans Like, don't you dare try to go for Sinai, you bastard. You guys hop off the boat and get over here. Alright, you guys kill this unit. Hit the Cairo. You guys start making your way towards Ethiopia. And you can park right here in the Spanish territory. Increase our pan down here in Argentina.
Jesus, this attrition. This is gonna be a mess. We gotta cross this garbage. And if Ottomans take Sinai, I'm going to declare war on them. So I hope they understand the geopolitical consequences of their actions. We have to cross through this terrible, terrible, terrible terrain. Hang on, inorganic chemistry is almost done. Keep expanding these forts. All right, everything is gonna be all A-OK. -okay immediately done in here and once we get this up and running we'll be able to fully deal with the threat of these other powers all right you hit up here um how much longer we have on this cast's belly do 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 january 25th all right um you guys just hit up here we're gonna probably get a couple months in of recovery and then you guys begin the invasion Ugh, Egypt god damn you you had to do this right now at this very moment in time why couldn't you just like be happy with our sphere and we found the Egyptian tomb while invading Egypt so our archaeological excavation team working in the Valley of the Kings of Egypt has discovered a tomb from the 18th dynasty. The tomb is rectangular and divided into upper and lower pillared sections with a royal sarcophagus located in the lower section. This fantastic discovery has made our Egyptological department the talk of the historically aware in Europe. More prestige and more research points. Always good. And... Let us do this. Make these people more cautious so they can push in another reform. And then we're, I'm gonna have to go over here and kill this unit, go up there. We can put some more stock into Argentina right now, increase their opinion. And for the most part, we are going to be doing fairly well. Egypt still is not going to surrender, those pretentious bastards. Okay, uh, what we're gonna do, we're gonna have to do this. It's gonna be a pitch play, but I'm gonna have to take over this territory and use it as like a defensive position because we don't have the pop right now because of that shit attrition we walked through. All right, uh, can I possibly get it? They will accept a war in Ethiopia. Okay, we just got machine tools and Darwinism. Great. Hurry up, inorganic chemistry. We need you to finish like yesterday. And I have to deal with this damn conflict. <sighs> Great. Let me guess, they're doing this for the Sinai. Yeah, okay. Get over here, prevent them from sieging this shit down. And then I'm gonna have to possibly intervene against the Ottomans because they're doing this stupidness. See what you did? Causing me more trouble than you're fucking worth, you bastard. Alright, uh. Let's do this. I'm gonna go for that so we can try to pass some more social reforms. Um, you hit over here. Just prevent the Ottomans from taking this stuff. Egypt, you are so damn stupid. Ugh. I have no words for you. Just ugh. Increase our relations 
with our South American network. All right. Pressing the gaze. Okay, we should be safe from them trying anything. How dare the Ottomans do this crap? And then if I do this, it's gonna possibly lead to a conflict down here. Uh, great. Uh, great. You guys are. I want you to move down here just in case. There they are invading from that end. Let's just sit here and try to get in one like recovery. Not gonna be super great because we don't have associates as them, but it is gonna just do us fine nonetheless. Uh, if you go for battle group doctrine. Let's go for, let's go for this, uh, or should we, actually let's go for early railroad. Try to get this out of the way. There. Egypt just surrender. It is pointless for this to go on and you're gonna make it completely worthless for me to defend you in the future if you continue along this path. Egypt right now. Um, I swear, Egypt, if you made this whole situation worthless, go up there. Should have just let Ethiopia eat more chunks of you, you bastard. All right, let's add Argentina to our sphere of influence. All right, kill these guys. And I want you to loop around through there. You're gonna have to make me like invade the Ottomans now. So if they take Sinai, you're gonna be completely worthless for me to defend. All right, we got them. All right, let's go for wealth. Increase the voting. Population. Having to make me do this stupid shit, Egypt. How dare you? Look at this now. I am currently bogged into these damn African misadventures. I can lower Paraguay for right now. And let's go for Ecuador. And then afterwards, I'm going to turn my attention into the Middle East. All right. 
there goes my alarm. Uh, let's keep this episode going for a little bit longer because, I mean, why not? At least try to wrap up one of these wars. What the hell was I thinking? Uh, alright, you guys are dead. And we're moving back up. Of course, Ethiopia is gonna be a little bit longer than expected. Uh, I swear to God, Ottomans, I am going to. Ugh, goodness. If I can just do this, I could easily trigger uh, intervention and just smack the Ottomans around a little bit and they'll go away. Fine, I'll take your damn alliance just so you can shut up. And you guys head over here. Alright, railroads can be increased now. That's all fine and dandy. Um, what we're gonna do next, we're gonna go for breech loaded rifles. Just to get this out of the way right now. And yes, you guys are gonna be investing. Alright. That's done. Now we gotta deal with you Ottomans because you pushed it to this point. Back off. Hey, get out of here. Kill this unit. All right, we're gonna just dedicate one army over here to their territory proper. You guys get parked off there. We could probably put the pressure on them. You guys go through that. All right, they're not gonna really do too much over here. And I'm just gonna blockade them in. Yo, two Sicilies. Thank you. Let's get some assistance in here. And there. See how quick that was? Never make me do that again, Egypt. <laughs> Never in your fucking life make me do that again. Because if I had to, like, go full on a war with the Ottomans just to get the Sinai over your fuckery, I would have been pissed. Alright, you guys head down here. And... Alright, so I'm gonna wrap this episode up right here. Okay, so, the situation in Egypt has been rectified. Ottomans uh, got smacked around a bit, got scared, and they backed off. Exactly what I wanted to happen. And I'm gonna need to get military access from you, Egypt. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel if you would like to see more. And when we return, we shall finish up this war with Ethiopia and put them as a protectorate. So, I hope to see you guys again in the next episode. This is so Now this one is pure niceness. Pure niceness.